All right, let's go ahead and start building out our panels here. Uh, the first thing I'm going to start with here is this panel, which is the saddle part of the shoe. And uh, I'm just going to go ahead and click on the, oh, the pen tool, not the topology pen, but the pen tool. I'm just going to click four vertices here, two, three, and four in a counterclockwise direction. Uh, sometimes, occasionally, the uh, polygon that you draw is flipped the other way, and in which case you just select it and hit the F key, and I've, I've flipped that inward, but uh, hitting the F key will flip that polygon so that it is facing you, or at least facing the opposite direction that it is. So if it's facing away from you, just hit the F key. All right, so now I'll go to the Topology Pen tool, and I'm just going to hold down the Shift key and click the an edge and drag it out right about to there, and that's all I need to do there, and then drag that one up. And as I'm building this, I am going to make sure that I keep my edges where I want them to be. Uh, maybe one right there, and put that edge right there. Okay, so uh, I'm probably going to draw that guy down there and this one down here a little bit maybe pull that down a little bit and I'm just clicking and dragging those edges I'm not hitting any modifier keys or anything like that so I'm just gonna drag, click on this one drag that guy up there I'm going to adjust this edge it's gonna save me a little time later on click that right there and one more there so we're just roughing this in right now we're not trying to get a perfect uh, model here uh, and pull that guy up here. Notice I grabbed a vertice and drug it outward, holding down the shift key, and that pulled that uh, quad out for me. And if I get this within this proximity of this edge, it's gonna snap those vertices uh, together. And there we go. Now this guy is off. Now, don't worry if you get something flying way off into outer space like that. Just line up your view here where you want it to be click and drag that onto the background polygons and that should uh, snap right in place okay all right so that's getting there this doesn't take really very long so i'm just going to go ahead and uh, build out this uh, panel and probably just speed through this real quick. Now you'll notice that I'm working in polygon mode and trying to get my edge flows working as nicely as possible as I can in within the polygon mode and not uh, Catmull Clark's. All right, so I'm just gonna drag this guy, hold down the shift key, drag that up. And let's see, hold down the shift key there and drag that guy up there. All right, I think you're pretty much there with this. I'll probably move that up right about there and you can continue and just massage this model into into place as you go along so after noodling with this uh, panel a bit I came up with a topology that looks sort of like this so as you can see it's pretty clean um, and notice that I am keeping let's go to my polygons here notice here that I am keeping a clean edge all the way around this and the reason for that is that I'm going to want to address these stitches later on in the build so I have to keep that in mind and keeping a clean edge is going to allow me to do things with this panel that uh, are going to uh, make that stitch look a bit more realistic 
So that's it for the saddle panel. Let's move on to uh, some of the other panels. Mm -hmm.